Hey what's going on guys Samsung Galaxy Note 9 is currently in early development phase and if you don't already know let me tell you that there is still some hope of getting the in display fingerprint scanner on the Galaxy Note 9 Samsung display division has made some solutions for the in display fingerprint scanner and Samsung is seriously considering one or the another I seen was tweeted that we should expect in display fingerprint scanner on the Note 9 if that's the case it will be a big step up for Samsung in the right direction he also said that we should expect a bigger battery on the Note 9. The battery capacity on the Note 9 will be 3850mAh. This is a significant bump up from 3300mAh on the previous Galaxy Note 8 and 3500mAh on the Galaxy S9 Plus. The Galaxy Note 7 Fiesco was 2 years ago and in tech terms, it's kind of forgotten. That's why Samsung is trying to make the Galaxy Note 9 the phone for power hungry users. I'm still thinking by the way that how are they going to increase the battery size of the Note 9 because in size it will be almost similar to the Galaxy S9 Plus and with the Note 9 they even have to compensate the internal volume for the S Pen. The Galaxy Note 9 Snapdragon 845 version has recently been spotted at Geekbench with the scores of 2190 in single core and 8806 in multi core. These are really cool scores. For comparison, the Galaxy S9 Plus with Snapdragon 845 scored 2422 in single core and 8351 in multi core. These are fairly close numbers, but with the final software, you should expect these numbers to rise up even further. The RAM is still 6GB, no bump up in RAM this time, maybe with the Galaxy S10. Android 8.1.0 The Galaxy S9 is still running on Android 8.0 and this might be the reason why we are seeing this rise in scores even though hardware is exactly same on the Galaxy Note 9 and the Galaxy S9 Plus. Software is as important as hardware. There's still a lot of time left before the final Galaxy Note 9 hits the markets. We still have to confirm the design of the Galaxy Note 9 and also that will it feature the in-display fingerprint scanner or not. The cameras of the Note 9 will be straight away pulled from the Galaxy S9 Plus but hey no problem there these are excellent top of the line cameras so yeah guys this is the galaxy note 9 let me know do you think that samsung is going in the right direction by increasing the battery size of the note 9 even though you know what happened last time they tried something like this i will cover everything about the galaxy note 9 so make sure to subscribe for that and i'll see you guys in the next one peace out